everyone, next up in our handstand prep progression, if we've tried the quadruped walkout from knees because maybe we're having a little uncomfiness in our wrists and we still need to train the abdominals, the rib cage position, the shoulder mobility that is required for handstands, well, maybe you've tried that quadruped walkout from knees and maybe you're thinking now, I got that one. I mastered it. I have mastered it. <laughs> um, so the next step is just increase the lever, increase the load that you put on your abs. So it's really just a, a next step. It's a continuation of what you've already done. So we're going to just do all the same stuff. We push my neck away, tuck my hips. <sighs> I got my abs. I walk out. I try to get my butt straight, my head, my upper body up. Let's take a breath, make sure I got it. It's okay, let's do another one. And that was a lot better. Now from knees to feet, that is our progression. Quadruped walkout from knees to feet. That one's way harder to get in the right position, as you can tell by the heat on my face, dropping my glasses off of me. Um, but that is the quadruped walkout from knees to feet.